first of all, we are having a masterclass here in the Central Conservatory of Music in Beijing. And uh, I'm very, very happy to be invited here to have these students. I have no idea what's coming. I'm really excited. Super. Bravo. Very good. You have, a, you have a very, very good sound. For the very beginning, the, where is it diminuendo? Did you see there is a diminuendo? And then a crescendo. What you play, you play the crescendo. Yeah, have, we have different approaches. You know, uh, I was teaching today a lot about colors, about different contact points with the bow. They, they learn very well to play. They're very emotional, but uh, they don't have the skills right now to, to make these different colors. Can you try to do what's written in here? Because Rega was so German. He was exactly from here to here, Dominando, and then Poker, Dadando, Ritter, Dando, and Crescendo. He was very clear. Very good, very good, very good, very good, very good. Now, you know, a piece as exhausting as this one is very tiring for the body. That means if you stand like this and you do this constant moving, it's additionally tiring. Try like parallel, hmm? like shoulder width. And not like this. Like more like that. A little bit pointed to the inner side, not to the inner side. Pointed to the inner side. Yeah, a little bit. Now you're really, really grounded. Magic. It's the magic sound for me. Yeah, I. Uh, the Berlin Philharmonic is uh, the top of the orchestra in, uh, for me. The, 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 the most top. Slower, faster. Coming from, from, from the back, I think you have to calm with the arm and, and don't have too much tension into your sh in, in your shoulder. He said I was too, too tight, uh, too stressed too much. Uh, both hands uh, are too, too much stress. Uh, so maybe I should uh, more relax, uh, more relaxed. Yeah. Always the arm has to be free. Yeah. Otherwise, you are also vibra your vibrato is not free. And yum, big, and. Sing. And take your time and... It's very difficult because... So you have to have bow, you know, what is the bow? And you don't want the... You don't want the G sound, so 
Today, what I feel for the student here, it's about the sound, because um, yeah, in Europe, uh, really we have the this uh, sound, and especially the professors from Berlin. So I feel really what he talking about for every student, it uh, should be sound louder, and should be sound the uh, real sound for the double bass. It's hard work, you know, because you have to always with the bow look. Is the sound going on? Is you know and make bow bow make the sound. And you have to plan, make a plan, sing like sing it body, whatever you sing, <coughs> try to play that. <coughs> but you need a plan, you need to think like I want here crescendo, here I, I can go diminuendo, here I can take time. You always have to plan also this. You can change your plan, it's okay. But just to play is, is mostly then boring, you know? I'm actually very amazed, they're very young. They, the last one was 16 years old. Um, they're on a level quite amazing. Actually, they could get any place in any school in Germany. And it, the standard developed a lot. The meetings here with the students and the, with the professors were so charming and warm and open-hearted. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.